usually start at the top of the legs. Um, this, is the, this is the breast here, so this is the most difficult bit of skin because there's a lot of connective tissue that's attached to the, to the outer skin. So I usually peel this bit back first, then I trace up, trace up to the legs, the top of the, the, top of the shank there. And then once I've done that, I'm peeled it back, I work from the back. And then, as you can see there, I trace down to the bottom of the fork of the legs. And it should peel back nicely all the way back down to the bottom of the animal. Um, once I've done that, I'm going to cut the primals off. So the first things that come off will be the breast. So it's exactly like a lamb. You've got the breast of the lamb. So you take, you take an incision from there, all the way down. And cut it across there, and that will be the breast. The breast is great for pot roasting, slow cooking. You know. I'll bone the breast out, so you can see the breast bone and rolled. And you can, you, you, know, you can stuff the breast with anything you want. Seasonal, you know, wild mushrooms, chestnuts, you know, and uh, it's a really, really good technique. Obviously, you cook it really, really slow. Um, once I take the breasts off, I'm going to take the, take the shoulders off. So obviously there's two shoulders, there's one, one set, what they call a set of shoulders, a pair of shoulders. I'll take that off and go through that separately, then I'll take the legs off and I'll go through the different cuts that you can get off the leg. There's a lot of meat on, on these legs, so what I intend to do is take the shanks off. Um, so you've got venison shanks, just like lamb shanks. Um, then I'm going to cut the leg in half, bone it and pair it and into four small joints. The shoulder you can do, usually the shoulder is used for stewing, uh, for diced lamb, casserole, these sort of things. Also they make great sausages. Um, you, know, you can also use the breast for sausage as well. They're excellent. If anybody wants a good venison sausage recipe, they can't give me because I've got an amazing recipe. Absolutely amazing.